Okay, with three O's, not two, but I probably put up two because I'm probably retarded. But anyways, today's video is about cancers. It's cancer season. Well, it's not cancer season, but I'm a cancer, so I can give you insights on cancer. You know, now you're about to get the deep scoop on why you probably got that one cancer friend and why they so emotional or they not so emotional or they so heartless like me because, you know, every cancer is different. Well, not every cancer. There's really just two types of cancers in this world. So, you know, you're about to find out more about them. And I'm about to answer. Cancers range from June 21st to July the 22nd. Our element is water and our what's this the thing called? Our ruling planet is the moon and our element is water. Now I'm about to tell y'all whether these facts about cancers are true or not because they probably more than likely not. I know the perspective from a cancer female, because I am a cancer female, obviously, because I just said my birthday is June 25th, and it ranges from July 21st to the 22nd of June. I mixed that up, but whatever. Fact one, cancers are unforgiving when someone betrays their trust. That is so true, because look, like, if you, if you show me I can't trust you, and you just like, you do it, all you gotta do is one quick time for me to feel, be like, bye. Like, I honestly, I'm not a person for giving second, third, fourth, fifth chances because I'm just like, why would I do that so you can just hurt me and run over my feelings again? And I feel like cancers, they mostly protect their heart, like, because we love so deep, like, so we barely let people in. Like, it's really hard to let, like, to get a cancer to open up to you. I mean, if you do it on the first try, well, kudos to you, cause, Never, ever in my life have I ever, never. I probably ain't never even been in love either, but that's besides the fact, you know, nobody needs to know that. Fact two, when arguing with idiots, a cancer will bring up everything you did in the past to show you how unreliable you can be. And that is true also, because I hate unreliable people like, uh, it truly hurts my soul. Like when people say something and then they just do something else or like, for instance, like you go to with a friend and like they be like, oh, well, you know, I can get us home or I can do this and that. And then you get there and then you stuck there until 12 at night at freaking night and your mama is blowing up your phone. That happened to me before. So <laughs> clearly, um, yeah, clearly I hate unreliable people and I hate liars too. I think the worst thing you can do to me is lie to me because like, honestly, I'm a very honest person. So yeah, I mean, you know, if you ask me to tell you the truth, I'm gonna be like, your breast thing, nigga, like, what? Like, no, I'm kidding, I wouldn't do this, but in two ways. Fact three, cancers don't really argue, but when they do, they shut people up quick. That is very, very, very true. Like, I am, I'm not the type to really argue with people, like, and I know, like, I have a female, another female cancer, she's my cousin, like, never argue with people like i would just shut you down real quick by saying one thing and after i say my one thing i'm done it's just like i'm just gonna keep on saying okay if you keep on talking to me i'm just ignore you because i mean i don't like confrontation comfort whatever the word is conversation confrontation condensation i don't like it <laughs> like it's just it's not my cup of tea it's not for me so i just you know i stay in my lane not mind my business you go this way i go that way go our separate ways Fact four, is a cancer when you get a bad feeling about something, nine times out of 10, you're always right. Boy, this is so true. Like, I swear to God, like, oh my God. Like, I've been on some dummy missions and I just be sitting in the car looking on the window like, this is not gonna work out. Like, I know something's gonna bad gonna happen. Like, I just be feeling it in my heart and my soul. And like, it'd be my, that conscious, my conscience would be like, look girl, you need to just turn around. Tuck, drop, hop out the car. Like, 
Oh, I got some crazy story times about where my conscience told me not to when I did it anyway. And yeah, just didn't end up good because I clearly didn't listen to my conscience and my gut and my cancer tuition. It was trying to tell me and I just decided to go with my Gemini and be all uh, hard headed and stubborn. So yeah, that's true. Fact five, hear me and hear me good. And irritated or pissed off cancer gives zero f about your feelings. <laughs> Let me tell you, like, oh, that is true. Usually, every other website be like, they cry, baby. Like, this one is giving you the truth. Like, cause if I'm irritated or mad, like, and then you start crying or something, I'm just look at you like, it's really just gonna be like, okay, like, and I'm I get real quiet when I'm irritated and mad too, so. I just be like in my own little world, especially when I'm mad, because sometimes my feelings get the best of me. So I just be like, kill, kill, kill in my head. So I just have to be quiet and just like sit there and like count to three or something, because honey, I could end lives when I'm mad. Okay, that fact was true, that's five. Fact eight, behind a cancer's fake smile is everything you need to understand. No, that's not true. It's not true at all. Fact seven, cancer hates when the spotlight is on them. This is why they feel extra awkward. Anybody who knows me always says I'm super awkward or I tell them I'm super awkward. But partially, this is partially true because I love when the spotlight is on me. Like your girl wanna pursue her career in acting and obviously I wanna be big and famous, clearly. But I do feel extra awkward at times sometimes because you know, especially when I'm with like a group of people and I just be like, hmm, I don't like you, I don't like you, I don't know you, and I still don't like you, even though I don't know you, I don't like you. Like, it's just like, I don't know, like, people are not my cup of tea, but in the long run, I'm, I'm gonna get better. I'm gonna get better. Fact nine when feeling down, shuts off all communications with others so they don't expect them to answer you. 20 calls. I mean, your 20 calls. That is very true, cause, hmm, like, I shut down from time to time. Like, I can't, it can't even be my zodiac sign though. Like, I believe like everybody goes through this, like they just get sudden waves of sadness or depression. But probably, it's probably cause of my zodiac sign. Now that I'm reading up about this, like I never knew that was like a trait or a fact of all a cancer, but yeah, like I shut down, I delete all social medias, I go ghost, I don't text anybody back. Like I don't even give people a warning, it's just be like, okay, I'm not feeling life no more. Like I'm just gonna delete everything. Stay in my room all day, hide under the covers, snuggle my baby, and just be like away from life and put my headphones in my ear because I love music. Anyways, that was true. Fact. They got two fact nines on here. They meant, no, they meant 10. Then this would be 11. Oh, they fucked up. I mean, they messed up. Fact 10. What makes a cancer super duper happy? Family, friends, fun, food, and good finances. Yes, 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 yes. Even though I only have five friends, you know who you girls are. Love you guys. And I only have like, certain amount of family that still loves me because the rest of them just stopped coming around but whatever and good finances I always gotta hustle so yes I love when my money is straight because I don't have to worry I don't have to ask my parents who will more than likely make a big fuss out of giving me money so yes that is so true finances is everything fact 12 oh wait did I just skip that one This one is true, so I'm gonna just go ahead and read it because I was I touched on this earlier in this video, so I'm gonna just go ahead and read it. Fact 10. Something you may not know. They know the wrath that they are capable of, so they try to keep it hidden away. Boy, because like people be thinking like I'm a punk, because like I don't fight, I don't let's see, I don't fight, I don't argue, I don't do internet beef, I don't talk to people. 
I don't do confrontation. And they just be thinking like I'm a punk, but no, like I just I know what I'm capable of. And I know in my head all I think when I'm like mad or mad, upset, angry, anything, enraged, whatever you wanna put it, I just be like kill, 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 kill. Like Woo, like I'd be ready to kill somebody for real. Like I don't even want to fight. Like fighting is not what I want to do. I will pick up a weapon and like stab somebody in a moment. Like the thoughts that happen in my head when I'm mad is just like nobody, nobody will even like think like they think like you need to put this girl in an asylum because she is clearly crazy. But you know, I just I just sit down. Now I, I told you I count to three. I'm like one, two, three. Cause boy, do I get mad. I get really mad. I get enraged. <laughs> All right. Fact a uh, 12. Friendly reminder, a cancer will move mountains and swim across oceans for anyone they care about. True. I'm not gonna elaborate on that because it's just true. Fact 13, cancers prefer dealing with a dealing with problems on a logical front. So getting loud and making scenes doesn't work with them. I just said oh, I just said that. Like I mean, well, I kinda just said that. I didn't say it like that, but yeah. But like cause when you when people scream at me, I don't know, like it'd probably make me cry. <laughs> like not if we arguing, but like if you're just screaming at me for no reason, like it just, I shut down. I'm not gonna say nothing. I'm gonna just sit there and look at you like you dumb. Like I'm just gonna be like. And you're probably wondering like why I'm not arguing back, but it's because I can't, I don't like to argue. Like it's just like getting loud and all that nonsense. It's just like for what? For why? Like why would, would you want to do that for? Like it's just annoying. Like and you making an a hole out of yourself. Anyway. Fact, we gonna go to 14. Well, they numbered this wrong, but whatever. Fact 14. No other sign can do for you what a cancer can. Yes, 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 yes. That's true. <laughs> Obviously, because cancers are perfect. You know, <laughs> we are the best. And this is the last fact. I'm going to read off of this website and then I'm just going to go ahead and last fact. Let's see. I want it to be a good one. That's a lie. Oh, I just have to say this even though this isn't the last fact. That is a lie. Kansas have a hard time saying no to people they care about. Or, and some selfish people take advantage of that. That is not true. Like, my mama... I know she cared about me a lot. We are both cancers, and she said no to me all the time. My cousin says no to people all the time. Me, personally, I'm always telling people no because, yeah, like, you don't need nothing from me, and I don't need nothing from you. Like, what do you, what do you want? Like, oh, my God. Anyways. Oh, here is one that is very true. This is the last fact. You know, if you know me, well, if you read my poetry, you know this is true. If you read anything that I wrote, you know this is true. Cancers are amazing writers. Because of their hard shell, they are better written word than spoken. That is so true. Like, um, I just told y'all it's hard for, to get me to open up, but when I write down my feelings, it's just like, it just flows. Like, it's just like, whew, it's like relief. Cause like, I can just let it go. Cause I won't tell nobody none of the stuff I wrote down, like or I write down, but I will write it down and share it to the world. But it don't be everything. So don't get me wrong. Like I don't just be sharing my whole life story through my writing, but it be mainly my feelings and how I feel and what I go through. If you want me to do another video on zodiac signs or any other zodiac sign or your zodiac sign, comment down below what your zodiac sign is and tell me some traits about you or somebody else that you know. Um, share some stories with me about cancers, you know. You know, a lot of people love us and we're very funny, by the way. Huh. Me, prime example. When I look at the camera, I wonder do I look weird. But anyways, that's not the point. But yeah, share some stories. Hey. I forgot to put who we're compatible with. And, you know, if you are a young dark male and your sign is compatible with mine,
Shawty's pretty, my man.